Hey, I'm Alan Brito from Blender 3D Architect, and welcome to this tutorial about managing add-ons in Blender. Last week I posted a tutorial here on the channel about how you can uh, install, uh, remove, and uh, locate add-ons for Blender 4.2 from the official repository. But there was uh, one subject that was missing from that uh, tutorial, which is how to update add-ons. One of the biggest advantages of having all of the add-ons and teams of Blender in a central location is the ability to push add-ons, uh, to push updates for those add-ons. For instance, uh, when you open Blender and you see this small icon here of a globe with a number one, it means we have one add-on that needs an update. Let's see how it works. It's quite simple. You just have to go into Edit, Preferences, and you will see a list into the Get Extensions. If you go into Add-ons, you won't see anything special here. You will see a list of your add-ons. Uh, it will uh, display your currently installed add-ons, but there is no hint about updates. If you go into Get Extensions, you will see a list here at the top with your installed add-ons. I have here the 3DS Max Important, which is fantastic. And it's uh, saying that it needs an update. I currently have version 1.5.1 and they just did an update for this uh, add-on. How can I uh, install the update? Simple, just go into update and it will download the latest version of the add-on. It's that simple. But just as a reminder, you need to grant internet access to Blender if you want to uh, get your latest versions of any add-ons that you have installed. You can control that going into system and here into network, you can allow internet, uh, you can allow online access to Blender. That's it. This is how simple it is to update your uh, add-ons from the official repository in Blender 4.2. I hope you liked the tutorial. Uh, if you find it uh, useful, if you uh, want to help the channel, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. I see you next time. Bye.